Okay, so now it's time for my swordfish, pan fried swordfish with this most delicious rocket lemon and caper kind of green salsa. It's absolutely delicious, really fresh and bright. So we're gonna start off, we've got these gorgeous swordfish fillets here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna season these with some salt and pepper. So do one side and then when we put that side down in the pan, we'll season the other side. So I'm just gonna pop some olive oil into my pan and get that heating up. Then I'm also gonna heat my smaller pan because we're also going to pan fry some capers. So capers, obviously you don't need to cook, they're pretty cooked, but when you heat them in a pan, they pop up, puff up and go really crispy. And they're absolutely delicious with this dish. So I'm just gonna pop some tablespoons of capers into a little bit of olive oil in this pan. And I've drained these capers. You don't want all the liquid going into this. No need to rinse them though. So this really is a super simple, quick dinner to make. So let's get our fish seasoned side down into the pan. Swordfish is a really meaty fish. So if you've got somebody who's a carnivore in your house who prefers meat to fish, this is a definite really good meal to make because it's a type of fish that I'm sure that most carnivores would like. You can see from the other side. I'm just get that cooking. Okay, whilst that's cooking, we're going to make our super simple, delicious salsa to go with it. So I'm just going to use my blender for this. I'm just going to put a bag of rockets, pre washed rockets, in here. And then to that, I'm going to add more capers. I'm going to add a couple of tablespoons of capers into this. And then I'm going to add the juice of half a lemon. You want to juice that over your hand in case any tips do come flying out. You don't want to use the tips. So our papers are really starting to crisp up now. And then I'm going to add olive oil. Really good olive oil. So this goes hot. I'm just going to give it a blend. And that's the salt you've done. Our papers are cooking nicely. Time to turn our fish.
So it's time to plate up. Our swordfish is cooked, our capers are lovely and crispy, and we've got our perfect green salsa ready. So we've got our platter to share and a serving for one. So we're just going to sprinkle over. Some of our crispy capers. And then to finish it off, our delicious green salsa. Cooking never got as easy as this.